is going on back here. Oh, Mrs. Trombley, you aren't going to believe what happened. That's probably true. Well, a couple of months ago, I sent all of my fashion designs into fun. Fun? F-U-N, Fashion University North. It's located upstate, and there's only, like, the best fashion design school in the whole country. I am able to understand about every third word that comes from her mouth. That's better than I'm doing. Anyway, they're holding a fashion camp there this summer, and I thought I would apply, you know, just for fun. And they accepted me. Oh, Blythe, that's wonderful. OMG, it's like a dream come true. Maybe the summer will turn into fall, then winter, then spring. Who knows how long I'll be gone? Maybe I'll spend the rest of my life studying fashion design. I gotta go start planning. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Blythe's going away? Oh, jeepers. Gone for the rest of her life? Oh, that's not good. <sighs> You think about all the things that you love to do It all comes true You find a place you never knew Where you're happy to Just be you We can be yeah. who we wanna be yeah. And little Miss Ketchup, you and me We can be yeah. who we wanna be yeah. And little Miss Ketchup, you and me Told us that she's leaving, leaving us with heads and hearts a grieving. Fashion camp is calling her name, but none of us will ever be the same. Inseparable, that's what Blythe and me were. Actually, I think she and I were closer. Was it me? Something that I said? Did I joke too much about her giant head? Oh, boy, just stay here forever. Train's ready to go. You step aboard, my tears they start to flow. What went wrong? What should we think? Is it me? Do I stink? Can't you see me crying? No, my tears I can't contain. <laughs> Luckily, we left him standing near a drain. Oh, Blythe, just stay here forever. Rest in Blythe, don't leave us forever. Life will never be the same. I think Ross is to blame. Hey, Blythe, just stay here forever. Please don't go. Oh, I'm going to miss you. Oh, my eyes are wet. Hey, knock, knock. Who's there? My broken heart. I stay here forever. Maybe I am to blame. Oh, look, everybody. There's no need to panic about this. I'll have a heart-to-heart -heart with Blythe and get the details. Maybe it's not as bad as we think. Huh? Russell is right. It's probably worse. And this is where the dorms are. And those are the classrooms. Oh, and look, that's the gallery where the students display their latest designs. Isn't it the coolest canvas you've ever seen, Dad? 
It's in the top five for sure. It looks like your days will be jam-packed, full of activities. But it'll be a B-L-A-S-T! Ah! Ow. Yeah. A total blast. It is okay for me to go, isn't it, Dad? Well, um, you see, I would have to say... Of course it is, Blythe. I'm sure going to miss you, Blythe. Have you heard the horrible news? Blythe's leaving! No, of course you've heard. You're her father. That much we know. But don't worry. I have a plan. We framed Blythe for a crime she didn't commit. So we'll place her under house arrest, and she'll have to stay in the apartment the whole time. Well, I don't think we can do that, Mrs. T. Oh, you're right. She'll need to get out to work in the pet shop. But... What if she tries to run off to the fashion school? <gasps> ninjas! That's it! We'll hire ninjas to secretly keep an eye on her! Chillax, Mrs. Twombly. She's not going to be gone for the rest of her life, just for the summer. That's still too long! We've got to do something! No, we don't. What? You've seen how excited she is. I think the right thing to do is to support Blythe as she pursues her dream. Even though we'll all miss her like crazy. But... Oh, you're right. I know you are. Still, I just can't imagine this place without Blythe. Neither can I. Neither can I. F-U-N, Fashion University North. It's like the best fashion design school in the whole country. Hey, that is fun. Literally, F stands for fashion, U stands for... We get it, Jasper. Where is it, Blythe? Well, that's the one negative. It's not in town. My dad says it's either a short flight or a long drive away. I'll be gone for most of the summer. What? That stinks! Jasper! Well, it does. Blythe, this is your dream come true. We're totally happy for you. Aren't we, Jasper? Oh, yeah, right. This is super cool, Blythe. You gotta have fun! Sweet! See you guys tomorrow! Last day of school! Woohoo! Well? The good news is that Blythe's not going to be gone for the rest of her life. Hooray! The bad news is that she will be gone all summer. Aww. I have no idea of how long that will be. Me either. Downers are delicious! So this morning was the last time Blythe is going to feed us for months? <sighs> what? I'll starve! Ow! Huh? Keep your tail on, Vinny. Mrs. Twombly will feed us. It's just... Well, Blythe always laughs at my jokes. And compliments my paintings. And Blythe always takes us on fun trips around the city. Is Mrs. Twombly going to take us to the park? Huh? Uh, I love the park! Settle <laughs> down, everyone! Blythe really wants to do this. And just like her dad said, we should support her. So, what do you say we put our worries aside and work on coming up with the best going away presents ever? Yeah. 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 Okay, let's do it. No more Blythe till September, either. <sighs> Thanks for reminding me, Jasper. Remember, you two, we gotta totally support Blythe and not let her think we'll miss her or do lots of fun things without her. It'll just bum her out, and that's not fair. So I shouldn't show her these zany island grand reopening passes? <laughs> <laughs> What's going on? <gasps> OMG zany island grand reopening tickets! That's gonna be so much fun! For... You guys. Not even close to the amount of fun that you're going to have. You're actually going to a place called fun. Uh, how fun is that? Hello, Blythe. Others. So, Blythe, we heard you were leaving town. For good, we hope. <laughs> <laughs> nope. Back at the end of the summer. <laughs> Too bad. For us. 
Well, I didn't expect they would miss me. But you guys will, right? Oh, don't worry about us, Blythe. We'll get along just fine without you. Yeah, I mean, we'll We're be gonna cool. Have a great we got summer. lots to do oh, and stuff. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, guys? <laughs> what makes you think there's something up? <laughs> yeah, it's not like we were planning any surprises or anything. Ow! Oh, Zoe, I'm sorry I haven't had time to work on your summer fashions. I've been so busy getting ready for fashion camp that I... Oh, no worries. I couldn't care less. Really? Sure, I don't need any special fashions for summer. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. In fact, Blythe, we don't need you for anything at all this summer. So you should just go to that school and not think about us. Oh, well, th that's great. I guess I'll see you later then. Yeah, well, maybe you will and maybe you won't. Just don't worry about us, because we won't be worrying about you! Ow! Ugh. Why do you keep doing that? Because you keep saying dumb stuff! I thought we were supposed to act like we wanted her to go. Now quit it with the chicken. Okay, let's hear what you're thinking about doing for Blythe's going away present. I'm working on a new comedy routine around how we can talk to Blythe and understand her and stuff. I, Sunil the Great, am working on a new magic trick. I call it... Although Blythe is disappearing for the summer, she will be reappearing in the fall. I'll be interpreting Blythe's importance to us to a fabulous rhythmic gymnastics routine. <laughs> fabulous new song! I'm working on some kicking new moves. Check it! <laughs> so, what do you think? Keep working on it. Minka? I'm painting a fantastic piece just for Blythe, of course. Okay, that leaves... me. Hmm, what am I gonna do? Keeping in mind that some of the pets are herbivores. Ew, herbivores. I like that word. It makes me think of salads. Oh, Blythe, just in time. I'd like you to meet Madison. Hi, I'm Madison, but you can call me by my nickname, Madison. Madison will be taking your place while you're gone this summer. Really? That was fast. I haven't even left yet. Oh, I didn't want you to worry about us this summer, so I did an exhaustive search with numerous candidates. Hey, you! You want a job for the summer? Sure. <laughs> Come on, Madison. I'll show you around. <laughs> Russell, my replacement is right behind me. Tell everyone to talk so I can see if she understands you. Why? Was she in a dumbwaiter accident, too? Just do it. All right, right, right. So, this is the day camp area where the pets hang out every day. And these are the pets. Say hello to Madison, everyone. Well, hi, Madison. Hi, Madison. Hi, Madison. My, they're very noisy, aren't they? They're talking to you. Well, I don't have my animal to English dictionary, so I don't know what they're saying. <sighs> That's all I wanted to hear. Hello, pets. I know we're going to get along just fine, as long as you don't breathe on me. And who knows, if life doesn't come back, maybe I'll just have to stay here for good. <laughs> Blight, you're gonna miss me I'm trying not to boast Blight, you're gonna miss me You're gonna miss me most Me Well? Yeah, um, can you make it a little more about Blight and a little less about you? I'm not quite following you You know how you say you're gonna miss me? Uh, yes. Oh, I love that part. Well, maybe you should instead say something like, I'm gonna miss you. Hmm. Let me see what I can do. Okay. Next. Thank you! Hey, it's great to be back at Littlest Pet Shop. <laughs> so anyway, you know your pet is talking to you when your pet says something and you say, what? Who 
Okay, that one needs work. Um, you know you're a human who can talk to pets when you start talking back to them and they say, what? Hold on, that's not good. Uh, that's okay, I know where you're heading with these. Next! I plead for forgiveness, Russell, but I cannot perform my disappearing trick. Why not? It has disappeared. Next! Keep practicing. Amika, how's your painting coming along? Don't worry, I'll have it done in time. Great. Well, it looks like everyone has something for Blythe. Except me. Fashion camp this summer? Zany Island Grand Reopening this summer. <sighs> I don't know. Maybe I shouldn't go to fashion camp. I wish I knew what I should do. Come in. <sighs> Life, I've got you all stocked up for camp. Wow, look at all this stuff. Ooh, a travel mannequin. <gasps> With Kung Fu Grip! Thanks, Ooh. Dad. You're the best. I'm gonna miss you so much. Oh, well, we'll talk every day and write letters and emails and yeah. postcards and... And you better finish packing because we're leaving bright and early. Are you sure you need all of this luggage, Blythe? Absolutely, Dad. They're mostly filled with my design supplies. Uh-huh. Okay. They're mostly my shoes, but I need them, Dad. All right. We'll get going right after I load everything up. I'll go say goodbye to the pets and Mrs. Twombly. Hey, everybody. I'm almost ready to leave. Blythe, we have a surprise for you. Have a seat. Hit it! Yet, Minka has a little something for you. That's you in the middle, surrounded by all of us. Oh, Minka, it's beautiful. I absolutely love it. Um, Blythe, I'm afraid I couldn't come up with anything to give you. What are you talking about, Russell? This whole thing was Russell's idea, Blythe. Thank you, Russell. I think I'll miss you most of all. <clears throat> well then, uh, Blythe's only going to be gone for a little while and she'll be back before we know it, right? Right! Let's go, Blythe! Okay, Dad! Well, time to go. Now, Blythe, I don't want you to worry about anything while you're gone. Between Madison and myself, we'll have everything under control. Oh, by the way, Blythe... As my going away present to you, I had a webcam installed in the day camp, so you'll be able to check in on the sweeties anytime you want. Really? TSC! That's, That's so cool! cool. <laughs> Are you okay, Mrs. T? Oh, just a little too much coffee this morning. It went straight to my eyelid. So, quick question, which one's Blythe? Have fun at fun, Blythe! <laughs> did you see what I did there? I made a joke! Oh, I'm gonna miss hanging with you guys so much! 
don't, because we're just going to be doing boring stuff. That's right, stuff you wouldn't want to do anyway. Okay, knock off the phony. It's going to be a boring summer act. You'll have fun like everybody else. I'll only be a little jealous. You better call me every night. And you better take a lot of pictures at Zany Island. Ready to go? <sighs> As I'll ever be. Dad, I wrote up a list of things for you to do while I'm gone. Water the plants, but not too much. Don't leave your shoes in the middle of the floor because you'll trip on them. If something in the fridge grows fur, throw it away. Sweetie, relax. I'll be fine. Okay, summer fashion campers. Check in with me before you get on the fun bus. Dad, you're going to miss me, right? I started missing you the second I found out you were going away. Now you listen to me, Blythe Baxter. You will not worry about me, or the pets, or your friends, because we're all going to be fine. All you need to do is concentrate on this wonderful opportunity and have a great time. Got it? Got it. Love you. Me too. Fashion camp, here I come! Wow, whoop-dee-doo! Hey, I heard that. What the huh? 